So it's last Thursday and I am just getting on the bus with a whole bunch of kids that I spend the summer with from many mansions. It's a summer camp for, for low income kids. And I'm sitting here with my bus buddy, Samantha. And Samantha gets on the bus, this little cutie, she's five years old, big brown eyes. Her hair is full of sand, it's everywhere. Her bangs are missing because she cut them off the week before. And she looks at me. And I know what this look is. This look is, what are we gonna do for the 45 minute ride home? See, on the way to the beach that day, we had been drawing pictures. She had a pad of paper and a pencil. We played hangman, we did all these games. And then when we were exhausted with that, we took out my cell phone and she tootled around on different apps. Well, my cell phone was dead and the piece, all the paper was gone. So what were we gonna do? She gives me this look and then she looks ahead. And little Samantha reaches down into her little bag and she pulls out her sunglasses. And then she goes and she reaches on top of my head, takes my sunglasses off, puts them in my hand. And she s proceeds to say, Hi, what's your name? All of a sudden, our sunglasses were friends. I, well, I'm Susie? Oh, hi, Susie. I'm Susie Lollipop. Do you want to come to my house? So for the next 35 minutes, Susie Lollipop and Susie went on an adventure together. We went to her house. I got in trouble for bouncing on her parents' bed. I got to see what she did in the living room and the shows she liked to watch. Next, we went to my house. We had to go up and down hills and zoom up and down slides. And we were at my house and I got to show her all the things that I like to do. Next thing I knew, she was inviting me back over to her grandma's house where we were gonna have a birthday party for her that day. We got to have pizza and we had cake and we had an awesome pinata that was shaped like a lollipop. At the end of that 35 minutes, I was full of so much energy. This little girl had tugged inside my heart and inside my brain and she unleashed this fantastic imagination that just filled me with so much life. What I'd like to say to all of you is if you have a little person in your life, you have a, a child or maybe you work with some kids that need some help or you've got nieces and nephew, take some time and let them show you where their imagination can take you and bring all kinds of new things to life. Thank you.